If you want five ways to change your skin today for the better, this is the video for you. Hey everybody, it's Lisa, owner of Peaches Skincare. You can visit us at peachesskincare.com where you will learn about our small batch concentrated skincare products and really about holistic skincare. You can also visit us on TikTok, YouTube, and Instagram to get a little bit of a different idea of who we are in my or our holistic Lisa skincare. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome. Please hit the bell so you know when my videos come out, typically Thursdays and Sundays and uh, like and subscribe help me to get this message out and if you don't know what that message is go back and look at a few videos but essentially i am 58 i'm a pro ager i would not erase my wrinkles for anyone but i want to be my best for who i am at this stage in life what is 58 right um and i wear no foundation and concealer in these videos what you see is real skin a woman who is aging, who takes care of herself, who travels, um, who has raised two beautiful adult children now, and has been married to my husband for almost 40 years. These are all things on my path that I have had. Tears, joy, and it's normal and healthy. I don't want someone to look at me one day and say, who's that? <laughs> I want them to say, wow, that's Lisa. She just looks a little older. Or I guess they wouldn't say older. Maybe she looks wiser. But my goal is to change the dialogue that especially women and younger women are getting about age and about what is beautiful. Do we have to pile layers of foundation and concealer on our face or inject our lips or you know, cut into our faces to be accepted and beautiful? Or can that standard be changed? And that's what I'm trying to do. But if you do those things and they bring joy to your heart, I want you here. I'm just gonna always try to teach you how to do things more holistically. So five things that you could do today. First of all, go for a walk. Go for a very long walk, really get the blood flowing, move your arms. If you wanna try running, you can. Um, if you can only make it to the end of the driveway to get your mail today, but you walk really fast or run, go do it. Blood flow creates oxygenation of skin cells and makes your body healthy. If you, I'm gonna add this to one, even get the blood flowing on your face by doing massage. And I have several videos showing facial massage, facial yoga, do it. Blood flow creates oxygenation of skin cells and therefore also creates collagen at any age. Just doing that today, you will be amazed. Number two, I want you to try to not drink any soda, any alcohol. Uh, if you're a smoker, that's gonna be tough for you, I get it. But try not to put anything in your body. Consciously eat or drink what you do today. Put nothing in your body that isn't good for it. And if you even did this for two days, you would be shocked at how the swelling under your eyes will start to go away, how your skin will look vibrant and brighter. You will be amazed. Our body is constantly purging out impurities through many of the toxins of things we eat or put on our body. And at night is when it does it especially through many of the organs, including the largest organ of the body, the skin. So do this and you will be shocked what your skin will look like in the morning and if you can keep doing it even over a few days. Sodas, sugar. It's not that I don't eat a cookie, but I'm very mindful during the day of what I eat, what I put in my body. Green tea is what I would prefer. When we go out, Kent will love a glass of wine. I will just get a sparkling water in a pretty wine glass or champagne glass of lime, but I feel better. I just enjoy that. Number three, kind of ties into this. I just said how our body heals itself overnight. Wear a mask to bed. Wear milk of magnesia. It can be a only original flavor. Please don't worry about um, sodium hypochlorite. It is nothing to worry about. Um, I did a video four years ago where I wasn't sure, but I've used this for 40 years and it was something brought to my attention. I thought, ah, should we be aware of it? But after talking with my chemists and other chemists and physicians and pharmacists, this is something people drink. Milk of magnesia is amazing. It is not going to dry you out if you're a peach. That is not what's drying you out. It's something else you're doing. Could be the environment in your room. Maybe you need a humidifier. Um, it's also going to pull things out of your skin. And sometimes when it pulls things out, 
funguses, bacteria can look dry, can look irritating. It's not the milk of magnesia doing it. It is anti-inflammatory healing. And although I'm a pro-ager, it is anti-aging. I have worn it for over 40 years and I don't have crepey skin. And I really attribute that to wearing a mask overnight. If you're a peach, uh, we will be rebranding Purifying Acne Stick as an overnight recovery mask. Um, whole long story about that, but they took my milk of magnesia on a very long trip to Europe last year, and I did what my daughter um, had been doing and started using it, and we were blown away at the results and have tested it for the past eight, nine months. Um, it will be for uh, inflammation, acne and purging, texture and discoloration. But wearing a mask tonight to bed, you will be shocked how it will gently uh, dry up any pimples, uh, bring out some things that maybe you can wrap tissue around your fingers and push those out in the morning. But you will be amazed at what wearing a mask to bed will do. Number four, I want you to um, make sure to drink your apple cider vinegar. You should be applying it to your skin as well. So we have an ACV toner because it smells a little better and clients didn't like making their own, but you can take apple cider vinegar with the mother. Um, everyone has a very particular brand that they like and you can pour three quarters of it in a spray bottle with a quarter water. And you can spray that on your face morning and night after exfoliating and cleansing if you're a peach. You will be amazed, even if it stings a little bit in the beginning because it's killing bacteria and fungus, how that will start to change the pH of your skin and start to help heal bacteria and fungus that is always on our skin and we have issues with if we leave an opening for it with bad products, bad sunscreen, um, being waxed, um, just different things that I go over in different videos. Also drinking it helps the flora in your stomach or your gut health. When our gut health is great, we don't break out on our face. Um, our pores are not clogged. That's another reason to not break out, which are really hair follicles, but really gut health, going to the bathroom regular, that kind of thing really is significant for your skin. And then the last thing, wear a wide brimmed hat. Wear a hat outside. I do. Many times I don't really have sunscreen on if I'm just walking down to the corner bakery or um, walking around the corner to my girlfriend's house. I just have my wide brimmed hat on. This is a hat, so many of you will see me in my lifeguard hat. I, I forgive me that I don't have it on here, but you will see me in this hat if we are going out to dinner, if we are going somewhere. It covers my face, the sides of my face, my neck and my chest. And many of you who are wearing baseball caps, you are doing significant damage to your chest and the sides of your face. I cannot say how much wearing a wide brimmed hat matters, even or wearing good sunscreen. If you're not wearing a hat, forget it. And again, this is after taking care of hundreds and hundreds of thousands of clients in almost 40 years. So those are my five tips for changing your skin today. I hope I've encouraged you. You can email me at lisa at peachesskincare.com or info at peachesskincare.com if you want help with your skin or to become a peach. And I hope I've encouraged you to all uncover your true confidence.